All right, y'all, it's Brad Allen. This week, we're gonna take you on our area tour of Gilbert, South Carolina. Now, Gilbert is a name you've probably heard a lot about in the Midlands, but you may not be quite familiar with it. So that's the point of this video, to let you know what's going on in the great town of Gilbert. So a little history on Gilbert. It was actually been around since the early 1700s when Jonathan Gilbert kind of settled that land just southwest of Columbia. It also had a couple of name changes over the last centuries from Gilbert's Hollow to Louisdale back to Gilbert. And this coincided when the trains came through from Columbia all the way down to Aiken, really putting Gilbert on the map. And talking about trains, one of the greatest things to do is go see Gilbert's Train Depot, which was redone in 2012 and it's become a museum, not of just trains, but also Gilbert, giving you a little bit of insight of what that era was like all the way back into the 1700s. One of the other popular things to do in Gilbert is Clinton C's Farm. It really comes to life in the fall as they open up to the general public with corn mazes, pumpkin patches, and a spooky Halloween trail. Once you're done checking out everything Gilbert has to offer, you really need to go check out Joey's Sandwich Shop. It is a staple in the Gilbert area for good American food like pulled pork barbecue, club sandwiches, and all around just good eatery. If you're into wines, believe it or not, Mercer Winery is just north of Gilbert and has over 50 different blends of wine they produce each year. It's a little secluded, so you gotta look for the signs, but it is a fantastic place to go do a nice wine tasting. So let's talk about housing. When it comes to housing, one place comes to mind when it comes to Gilbert, White Plains. And it's one of the only places I know in the Midlands, if not the state, that is a community based around airplanes. There's a private airstrip, which every single house has access to with their own private hangar, usually at their house, to go and come as they please in their own private aircraft. So one of the reasons you might like to call Gilbert home is one is proximity to Lake Murray is about 10 minutes right up the road. You're also 12 minutes to downtown Lexington and about 30 to Columbia. But people also like to buy here because it's right near I-26 and a lot of our clients like to commute back and forth to Augusta and Aiken for work, but also be closer to the Columbia side, which is perfect to call Gilbert home. Over the last several years, Gilbert has really kind of turned into this cool destination. It's kind of an urban yet rural feel where people are moving to as places like Lexington and Columbia start to fill out and get a little bit pricey. We hope you like watching this video as much as we liked making it. If you could do us one little favor and just hit that like and subscribe button so we can make sure you get these videos as soon as we post them. And as always, if we can be your realtor of resource, whether it's living, buying, or selling in the Gilbert area, we would love to do so.